to kick off. Stevens. Game is enough for out here in the first down. With the 47. Thank <laughs> you. 
Christian getting close to the 35 yard line. Stuff was made by Stevens.
Jennifer on 32 yard line.
goes out of bounds. At the line of the floor, the
Good call. Oh, <laughs> 
first down on their own 31. Thank <laughs> you. 
Take the deep. That sounds like landing. Get part. Push down to the landing. Thank <laughs> you. 
and those passes complete to Cole Fiat. That's at the 42 yard line. Thank <laughs> you. 
ladies and gentlemen, the Northwest Ranger Marching Band proudly presents their 2023 field show, The Last Viking. The Last Viking is a show that loosely tells the tale of the decline of the Viking clan through music. The show utilizes Viking and sea shanties as well as famous hits from Led Zeppelin to tell the musical story. Segment one introduces the Vikings and gives the listener insight into the character and nature. Segment two features soloists Blake Strunk and Autumn Hardy and reflects on the descendants and history of the clan. Segment three is a percussion feature utilized, utilizing the famous drum beat and groove from Led Zeppelin's When the Levy Break. The segment represents one final battle which leaves the clan destiny to one last Viking. And segment four wraps up the show with an energetic closing segment using Zeppelin's iconic stairway to heaven, and it represents the last Viking descent to the heavenly realm. And now, please welcome the Northwest Ranger Marching Band and drum major, Ivy Smith Nelson. Thank <laughs> you. 
and gentlemen, the Northwest Ranger Marching Band. Ladies and gentlemen, we call your attention to the midfield area. High school football at South Williamsport has a long and distinguished history, beginning in 1907, when the first games were played on a field located at Mount Beach. The high school team moved to this stadium in 1932, and local history was established in 1937, when the first night game was played. Throughout these many years, many memories have been made by both the players and the fans. Tonight, we are pleased to welcome back members of the 1993 team who have gathered for a 30th reunion. This team, coached by John Zalonis and captained by Mike Moyer, Brett Zalonis, Ryan Barnes, and Nick Perini, ranks as one of the best teams in South Sport football history. That season, throughout its remarkable run to the Class A state championship game with a 14-1 record, the team recorded eight shutouts, outscoring opponents 486 to 71. Their wins included a 17-14 regular season win over Southern Columbia and playoff wins against Mahanoy area 23-0, Minersville 32-6, and Marion Catholic 13-0. While they dream of the state championship on a cold, blistery day at Altoona's Mansion Park, fell short and heavily favored Duquesne, scored a late fourth quarter touchdown for a 24-21 win. Their accomplishments are long remembered and are being celebrated by team members gathered here this evening. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome back members of the 1993 South Ransport County's football team. Scores of interest in the third quarter. It's Muncie 8, Houston 8, and halftime 4, 33, 10, nothing. Also at the half, Wellsock 28, Montoursville 7, Jersey Shore 49, Central Mountain nothing. Milk in the second quarter, 21 to 6 of the Warrior Run. Half, Southern Columbia 55, Chicklin and nothing. Half time, Williamsport 17, Pontanic nothing. Jamoka leads Mount Carmel at the half, 13 to 12. And Lewisburg leading Mifflinburg 28 to nothing. In the second quarter, the second quarter is 28. <laughs> Northwest 4 for 11 for 52. The total offense, South Mountains for 240 yards. Northwest 36. The Mountains have 13 first downs, the Rangers 3. South has been penalized twice for 20 yards. Northwest 5 for 50 yards. And as we had earlier announced in that first half, Ryan Casella, Rubbage game now tops the 1,000 yard mark with 1,024 yards on the season. We have the 50-50 drawing for those of you who participated. It is a yellow ticket. The yellow ticket 
The number is 574-523. That's 574-523. You have that number, and you will pay your prize on the press box. The winner of tonight's 50 50 drive, Dr. Eric Briggs, $237. He is donating it back to the program.
Conversion to Catholic, no good. Level four, remaining in the third quarter, not near 38. Northwest nothing. Boys pass is complete. And Andrew Bazinski. And to the 47 yard line. Is made by Ryan Bauer. Here at Cooley. Game is enough for a first down, but not near 49. to who got stop is made by Cooley.
Boys pass is incomplete. Who that? Stop me by Kaiser Kissinger. I've said the penalties. Side against the Mountaineers, holding against Northwest. to Deeks, brought down by Landon Gephardt, Rage is enough for a Ranger, first down at the 12. Thank <laughs> you. 
Two point conversion attempt is no good. Third quarter, well Sox 34. Now towards the second. At the end of the third quarter, Newsville 16, Muncie 14. About the 45 yard line. First down for the Mountaineers at the Ranger, 46 yard line. Fourth quarter, Newsville 22, 
2014. Was made by Kelly Johnson. Yeah. 
Stop by kissing them. First down for the Rangers at the 41 yard line. back to the 44 yard line it's second down First down. Then we can go out 11 yards to go. for another Northwest first down. Ball is at the 14 yard line. Fourteen yards on the pass. 
point conversion is good on the pass to Cole Kuda. Five minutes to go in the game is now Hughesville 22, Muncie 20. Who's going? We're covered by the Mountaineers. in the football, just short of the 25.
Jordan first down marker. Brings up a fourth down. So down. In the fourth quarter, what a side, 40, on Tuesday, 14. Two-point conversion is also good. Chunko. Taken out of bounds by Stevens. 
And the drive starts at the 24. Oh! 